Hi everyone, it's Happy Mail Queen, and I'd like to share a project that my daughter created. Um, this is an easel card. I showed her how to use an e uh, create an easel card, and um, she wanted to um, make one for her desk as school is starting. And um, we wanted uh, we actually set up a, a little desk for her, um, and I'll show you that in a minute. Um, that way she can do her homework and also, um, you know, it's her own little workspace so that she can also do her little art. And so that's her computer right there. And um, this is the desk. This is the hutch part of the desk here. And um, that's a book that she had worked on. And um, her keyboard's right here. And it's a little art studio for her, too. She hung her art there, and she has her big portfolio here full of all her um, paintings. And we just, I just hang her paintings up there, see? Works out for us. And um, she keeps all her supplies down here where her paint is and her paper pads, um, her art uh, tablets. And um, that's her easel. So then back to her project. She created this. Um, I'm going to put this down so it's not so shaky. She created this um, post-it note holder here. Easel card. And um, she used the Greeting Farm image Anya. Floor Anya. And she colored this all by herself. And then stickled it right after so I love the way she did her flowers there. She made uh, two-tone flowers, um, the pink and um, purple and um, blue and green on her hair. And then she um, even added boots. She didn't have boots, but um, she thought, you know, she needed some shoes. <laughs> so then... Um, she put some flowers there. I helped her hot glue the, the flowers in the corner there, the cluster of flowers, which I made um, using a tutorial, actually, that I got from... I watched JJ Shower's YouTube, um, where she uh, did a tutorial on the buds, the rose buds, how to make that, so that was fun to do. And I, it came out really cute. Um, and then we just punched out some flowers there to put her name and we thought it's a cute, it was a cute idea to just um, put the flowers on a vine there and just um, put her her name instead of making a name plate or a, you know like a name a banner um, so that that was a different idea that we, we came up with together and um, we just glued that on there on the vine and the vine is actually a, a Martha Stewart branch punch um, and then the paper line that she used in the background there is uh, the Prima paper um, collection um, Madeline is the name of it and very cute paper and she chose that for her project and then we just added a ribbon organza ribbon up on top there and that's about it. So, love the way that this came out. It, it looks very uh, Hawaiian themed, actually, doesn't it? Um, but it came out really cute and very vibrant colors. Um, so, I really love that. Okay, so thanks for watching, everyone. Bye bye.